Welcome, watchers of Illusion, to my castle of confusion. It's the 8th of February. Good morning. Hope you're having a lovely day so far. As I've literally woken up about an hour ago. Woohoo! Anyway. <laughs> yes, uh, office reshuffle has caused uh, the reviews to be stalled momentarily while we get all sorted out. And it's all done now. It's all done. I am now back up and running with full power. Yes. Um, so I do apologise for lack of. Um, I've, I've just literally got a new desk. So I've had to sort of like re-strip it down, get everything down. I've actually had to downsize as well. Uh, from three monitors down to two. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. The other monitor's still being used. Yes. On a different PC. But hey, never mind. Anyway, zooming secretary on the NES today. Which, if you're not if you're not sure what the NES is, it's a Nintendo Entertainment System, 8-bit fun and glory. Yes. So this is a homebrew gra uh, game. I don't know what a game is, but I do know what a game is. This is a homebrew game, and the idea is that you answer the phones uh, before they ring off the hook. Yes, indeed. Um, so you play the you roll of the titular secretary and you can see I am zooming around answering the phones yes now how do you answer the phones I hear you cry maybe I don't maybe I hear you cry oh, I was off it's too early in the morning for this shit anyway um yeah if you look above the phones there is a little icon and that icon is represented by the filing cabinets down the bottom of the screen or well, I'm guessing they're going to be at the bottom of the screen. And the idea is to get from the cabinet to the phone, answer the phone, and you can see there the phones do turn red. So um, you've got a limited amount of time before they turn white. As you can see, the top one, I'm probably not going to get there in time. or oh, got there just about. Um, and then they ring off the hook. And then you can only miss three calls before you're fired. Not very nice, is it? I mean, to be fair, if you're going to have an office setup where you've got three phones all in different places, you can't really expect people to run up, up and down ladders all day answering phones. So, yeah, yeah, it's not a very practical office, is it? Anyway, it's a level-based game, and uh, it's so it's such a simple concept, but works so well. And that's what we love about retro games, you know, games in general, really, isn't it? Um, we like a game you can just pick up and play, and there's no brain work required, because who wants that on a bloody Tuesday mor Wednesday morning? See, I don't even know what day of the week it is. Wednesday morning. Who wants that? And for those of you who work in offices, please tell me. Is this, a, is this a legitimate setup here? I don't think it is, is it? No. Um, how many of you have to climb ladders in your offices to answer the phones every day? Um, yeah, so there's, there's my point, really. Anyway, so the game's actually really good fun. Um, it's very simplistic, but you know what? That's that's what kind of makes a game fun. If you have too much to think about, then you know you, your brain. You have your, what we call a brain fart, which is such a lovely analogy, isn't it? But um, yeah, you don't want too much to think about in a game. You want to just pick it up, play it, and have some fun. Surely that's what gaming is all about. It is for me anyway. Uh, yeah. So zooming secretary is great fun and. Um, Graphically, it's really nice, and it's, it's this was released in 2011, and uh, it's. But it, you know, if you if you got this back in the day, I'm not sure I would have liked to have paid, you know, full whack for this back in the day. Cartridge games were like 40, but 30 to 40 pounds. That's a hell of a lot of money, isn't it? But anyway, um, for, I, I don't know, I even know how many levels there actually are in this game. There's quite a lot, and there's different staff members. You can see there's that woman at the top there. She's she's roaming around. Um, so she's she's obviously one. She's like I think according to the manual, she is the gossip of the office. So she'll change topics. Yeah. So if you run into her, <laughs> you might have your topic from the uh, filing cabinet. But if you run into her, look, she's changed it now. Bugger. So now I've got to go and get the uh, the correct thing again. I'm probably not going to get this now because that that's rung off the hook. Boo! That's that's her that's her fault. Anyway, um, but yeah, it's it's a great little game and graphically it's it's really just it's just simple and it works. It really really works and I like it. Animations are really smooth. 
Uh, you haven't really got too much to worry about. It's like I say, it's a screen by screen game, and it's just and it gets a bit manic as you can tell. Um, and we're only on day four. But there you go. I can't miss any more calls. I can't miss any more calls. No! Oh, bugger. I don't think I'm going to do this. Oh, I might do. Might do. Might do. Right. Oh, no. Poo. I missed the third call. There we go. Anyway. So let... Oh, I'm fired. And... And hired again. Hurrah! We always love that. Anyway. Um... So there you are. It's... It's... It is good fun. It is good fun. So the control system is nice and simple as well. Um, up, down, left, right. That's it. <laughs> You've got to worry about fire button. No, 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 not in this game. Um, it's just, it's just simplistic to the max, and I love it. I don't love running into her. She keeps changing my topics. Um, and you can see the filing cabinets are all quite spaced out. So you can sort of like jump over, not jump over, but you can run off the side and oh, I've got the wrong bloody thick never mind. There we go, I've 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 re royally screwed that up already. Oh look at that, I'm hired again. They must have real, real low options for getting staff in these days if I'm fired and then instantly rehired. <laughs> Lol. Anyway, um It is. It's just one of those games that you just can just chill out with a nice cup of tea and just have a bit of fun with. And that's that's what I think games should be about anyway. Um, so the, the creators have done a really good job with this. Like I say, it's a homebrew. It's great. It's it's um, it's actually I think it's it's out on the Mega Drive as well. I think I'll have to look into it. And if it is, I'm going to have a look on there as well because it's quite an enjoyable experience. Uh, so sound, you've got sound, and you've got music and all that kind of jazz that makes it up. I love the fact you've got different office workers that will either hinder you or help you. Now this this one here will change the subject that you've got. So you might get the world news from the filing cabinet. Um, but if you run into her, she might change to something else. But that can be beneficial as well because you might be running to one place and then she changes the topic just in time for you to get another one. Oh yes. But then, you know, Oh, missed it again, just as I was about to answer the sodding phone. Never mind. All part of the fun. But yeah, it's 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 enjoyable. So that leads me on to playability, and it is immensely playable. It's great fun. And um I think this could keep you engaged for a long, long time. It's very addictive, uh, because you just want to keep going and doing your best through the game. Oh, I didn't realise there was ladders that oh. see you see what I'm doing? I, I missed out the ladders on the first playthrough there, look. I can go up and down the ladders at the bottom and it takes me to... I wonder if I can go through screens as well. Can I go through the... I wonder if I can go through the sides. I'll check that in a minute, but uh, if I can do that, that's going to make life a lot easier, isn't it? There we go. So you can see at the top, you've got which day you're on, how many calls you've got to take, and how many you've missed. Now, you can only miss three calls in a day. Just be careful of that. Which adds to replay, doesn't it? So there's your there's a nice little link there going into the replay value of the game. Of course, it's it's replayable. It is it is it's great fun. Um, and I think if you're just looking for a game you want to chill out on, just kill a bit of time. You know, this is the perfect game for you. So there you go. Um, Zooming secretary. It's a great game, great name for a for a game, really, isn't it? Um, also, you'll notice there's a coffee machine there. If the coffee machine drops a cup of coffee, you can grab the cup of coffee and it speeds you up, as you know, as coffee does. Um, which, uh, which, which is quite helpful, really. Yeah. See, I think I, yeah, she just changed my subject to what I actually needed. That was quite helpful. Oh no, go oh, poo. Two calls missed. Oh, let's let's come on. No, don't. Let's. Oh man. Okay, so I've got. No! Uh, no! I'm gonna. No, I'm not gonna do this one. I'm not gonna do this one! No! We'll try again, though. We'll try again. There's a system to this game, and once you've got the system in place, you should find it fairly. Well, I wouldn't say easy, but. Anyway, let's try and get off this level, because it'd be nice to actually show you more than four screens. Yeah. Let's go, go, go! Let's answer those phones! Like a secretary on acid! Here we go! That's one. Hey, um. Oh, she changed the. Ooh. 
yeah, I don't think I'm going to do this one either. Oh, but we will keep trying, ladies and gentlemen. We will keep trying. Age rating. That, let's let's do that while I'm while I'm running around like a headless chicken. Um, age rating any. It's a, it's just a fun little game to play, and uh, it's it's oh you can go through the screen. Okay, that's fun fun. Uh, yeah, so any age group can enjoy this game, and I do mean enjoy because it is fun. Um, I've probably mentioned the word fun about twenty five times. Take that for what it's worth, because at the end of the day, if I'm saying it's fun, you know it's fun. Just change on for God's sake. I'm not going to do this one either. <laughs> and rehired again. It's one of those companies that just uh, hired, fired, hired, fired. It's just they, they don't care. Their, their work ethic is amazing. Anyway, folks, um, that's about it from me. I will be back very soon with something else. I did want to just do a quick one today just because I want everything, everything back up and running again. To, just to let you know, I'm still alive. Um things have been a bit tough over the last sort of couple of weeks and that and it's not going to get any better unfortunately but um you know i've got you guys to keep me occupied and i hope in return i'm keeping you entertained so until next time my friends i'll be back with something new very soon and until then i bid thee farewell i will catch you again very soon you keep it retro and as always it's bye for now bye bye